Freya brought home in her school bag a leaflet about it and uh, I read about it and thought you know maybe it's something Freya could do so I thought to start with we would just express an interest and return the form and take it from there really. I wanted her to get something in the school holidays where she could socialise with maybe some people who aren't just special needs and I wanted her to have new experiences and you know just try and grow as a person really. It is obviously very daunting when you've got a vulnerable child. It's a really, really big thing to just send them off on this activity. But we felt so confident with Mark. All in all, the contact we've had with the staff, that just totally set our minds at rest. And we just knew that Freya was safe with the NCS and if there were any problems, they would contact us. Everything was good, really. I managed to achieve a big fear of mine, of heights. Before I started, I was like, I didn't want to do it, but I managed to pluck up the courage to do it and I now feel really proud of myself. I think it was the like the support I was given, like the encouragement to carry on and not just give up. I know it's not just the staff that have supported Freya but all her new friends have supported her too and I think they've got so much out of being with her. There's a, a good bond going with a few people that I didn't even know before we came and it's going really well. I'd say the skills I've developed whilst I've been here at NCS probably teamwork and meeting people I didn't know before I arrived here. All I know is that Freya has enjoyed every moment with the NCS. I was really worried to start with. She went off on the bus, you know, and she looked a bit lost. And to be honest, I sort of wasted the first two days worrying. But then I was getting texts back from the staff just to say that she was having a really good time. And they updated me and set my mind at rest. And I could tell that she was really enjoying herself. And when she came back, she was absolutely, you know, full of confidence, she was full of excitement. I could see she was chilled out with her new friends and she was off to bed at seven o'clock on the Sunday night because she couldn't wait for the next day to arrive for the second week. And I didn't have a worry at all then because I could see the evidence, you know, that Freya was so happy. And she snuggled up to me actually at the end of the last week and she looked up at me and she says, I love, and she normally says my mum, but she says, I love group one. Yes, sir.